This is the remains of a 16th century packhorse bridge across the River Hodder in Lancashire, not far from Long Ridge and Stonyhurst College. It's taken the name Cromwell's Bridge. The Battle of Preston took place in this area in 1648, on the 17th to the 19th of August. Prior to the battle, Cromwell had marched his 8,000 soldiers and artillery across the bridge. The opposition commander was the Duke of Hamilton, a large number of English troops with him, together with Scots engagers, as they were called. The battle was an outright victory for Cromwell, and the last major battle of the English Civil War. He lost a few hundred soldiers, whilst the opposition lost 2,000 killed and 9,000 captured. Local tradition has it that Cromwell spent the night before the battle at the nearby Stonyhurst Castle. The occupants had been supporters of the King, and he took no risks. He was afraid of either being physically attacked or poisoned, so he spent the night in full body armour, sleeping on a table, surrounded by some of his troops. The bridge has lost most of the signs of its parapets. However, being a packhorse bridge, the parapets have been very low anyway. The horses would carry large panniers strapped to the sides, and the parapet would have got in the way if it had been too high. Lying a little upstream is the replacement bridge that was opened in 1819, the Lower Hodder Bridge. During the Second World War, J.R. Tolkien's son lived at Sonyhurst College. Tolkien himself was permitted use of a cottage on the estate, and here he wrote part of The Lord of the Rings. It's said that he was inspired by the Cromwell's Bridge to, to create the Brandywine Bridge, which features in the book. The bridge is a Grade II listed structure. It's mentioned in a number of the tourist guides. It gives the impression there's ready access and that you could even possibly walk over it. However, these days only Cromwell could get across. The access path has been fenced off with warning signs. The bridge itself, the upper bridge, which you can take photographs from, is very narrow and the traffic is busy. <laughs> 